Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to this Diagnostic World video. In this video we're going to demonstrate the iCarsoft CR Plus kit which is available at Diagnostic World. It's www.diagnostic-world.com. I'll put the link to this kit in the description and in the comments box below. Uh, in this video we are in a Toyota and we have the ABS warning light showing on the dashboard there. Uh, now we're using the iCarsoft CR Plus to diagnose this fault and uh, replace, uh, sorry, reset the warning light. So what we're going to do first of all is uh, we've plugged the tool into the diagnostic port and we're going to click on to diagnose. We're going to click on to scan and we're going to select our vehicle. Covers quite a few, make some models, but we're going to go through and select Toyota. Uh, we'll select the latest version, which is uh, always at the top. And then we're going to select our area. And this takes 10 seconds or so to connect to the vehicle. And then it'll give us a list of options to actually diagnose. So the, the system that we're looking to diagnose is the ABS system. So it's down here as ABS, VSC or TRC. And we need to click on to read fault code. So it's giving us actually one of seven fault codes here. Um, we've got C1241. And this is the one that we suspected we might get. Uh, well, actually not this one, sorry. C1333. Uh, rear speed sensor right-hand circuit. That's the one. C0210. And a few others. And the ABS system as well. If you do get a lot of faults, what's probably worthwhile doing is uh, actually clearing all the faults and then seeing which faults come back. Um, in this car, we know for a fact it was the rear right ABS sensor because we did a live data check on it. Um, so, it, yes, it's showing us a lot of other faults as well, but I suspect that once we erase these, all of those faults will go away and we should see an end to the ABS light on the dashboard as well. So we'll click on to erase fault data. Once I click yes, we'll keep an eye on the ABS light. Erase succeed. Okay, so the ABS light is still there. Sometimes it, you might need to come out of the ABS system for the light to turn off. Or indeed, in this case, it's staying on. In which case, you might just need to do a quick vehicle reset. So we'll stop the engine, and then we'll start the engine again. Let's see if the ABS light goes off and stays off. Yep, yeah, that's it. Stayed off now. Uh, so it's all thanks to the iCarsoft CR Plus, which is available at Diagnostic World. It's www.diagnostic-world.com. Uh, I'll put the link to this kit in the description and the comments box below. Thanks for watching, and I hope this helps.